Sherlock Phantom One here and welcome back. Today we are not doing a reaction or anything like that. We are doing a let's play again. I know it's been a while since we've done one of these and more to the point we're going back in the past because we're playing the game that everybody and their brother I'm sure has played or heard of. This game we're gonna play is Papa's Taco Mia. So let's get into it. I kind of get the basis of how to do this. I this everyone's played this at one point or another. So. All right, build station. This is this is the toppings. This is what you want. All right, hello, ma'am. How are you doing? I love your style. Your eyes are freaking me out a little bit, but that's okay. You want a taco with meat? Okay. Cheese, onions. Ooh, we're gonna disagree on that and hot sauce, okay. See, this always frustrated me. Why do I need to move the ticket over? Like, I can read it now. I don't need to move it back and forth. Are perfectly valid. Wait, okay, the meat has it. Well, yeah, it has though, it's brown. Oh, it's gotta go all the way to here, okay. All right, dump it in the taco. Now we got the cheese. Let's make sure she gets a nice portion of cheese. Woohoo, okay. Was that all she, no, she wanted onions too. I was gonna say that wasn't all of it. Let's get all the onions on there because apparently she wants onions for some reason. And then the sauce, most important part, get a lot of that on there. Here we go, one taco. Ooh, that was a really good one. 95 points and you gave me a $2 tip. Hello, sir, we're currently closed, but I'll take your order anyway. Okay, taco, meat, got it. Sour cream, okay, I'm with you so far. Beans, got it. Don't really like chives. I don't know what that green stuff is. I'm gonna assume guacamole. No, I bet you can overcook the meat if I wanted to. What does the knife symbolize? Like they wanted it chopped up? Because I didn't do that. Sour cream. Hey, everybody loves sour cream. Some beans. Got it. Let's get that on there. Lots of beans. I don't agree with this one. These, whatever these are. You can have that. And then where's this guacamole stuff right here? See, that would not fit in a taco. Look at that. Look at that over overhang. That is all gonna fall out one side. And he gave me a 93. This guy has no idea. I think he gave me a better tip than the other girl did though. This is false advertising because this is a soft shell taco. They do not have those. I love her style, but again, these hollow eyes are really freaking me out. See, we're gonna disagree, Zoe. You've already kind of bothered me by picking chicken over beef. Don't hate me to all the people who love chicken tacos over beef. It's just, I don't agree, but oh my gosh, here comes another customer. All righty, what do you want, sir? Another chicken taco. And he wants onions and tomatoes and lots of sauce. All right, time to flip the chicken. I don't know that you can use the same utensils on each of them because you're touching raw meats. And then you're using that same utensil again, but I'm not a chef, so I don't know. Guys. And then we're gonna work on Zoe's order. Oh, tickets are too close. We're gonna work on Zoe's order while we're waiting for that one. Here's all your nasty chives. I feel like that's plenty of chives. Lots of cheese. Not going for perfection here or looking pretty. And then get the sour cream all over it just to like kind of hide our mistakes. Oh no, there you go, have a good order. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for staying awesome. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to like and subscribe. And until next time, stay awesome guys. Bye. One foot in front of the other.